Hello YouTube and welcome to my channel. Uh, I normally don't do videos like this. Most of the time it is um, either Let's Plays or I'm in my car rambling about something or if I'm just kind of showing stuff off to my friends. That's kind of what I use this channel for. Um, so this is kind of a first for me. Cut me a little bit of slack. I uh, got a couple of apologies to make right off the bat. First of all, I've got kind of a mess behind me. I apologize for it. I've been working on a uh, multi-arcade machine emulator cabinet. Uh, so I took apart an old keyboard, took the controller card out, I've been soldering wires to it so I can connect buttons and joysticks directly to it so it'll be able to communicate with the computer that I'm using for uh, the arcade machine's brain. Second apology is I have my Akita Boxer Mix dog in the room with me, so if you hear cracking, tearing, or jingling, or various noises, that's her moving around the room. Um, you know, and playing and generally being a puppy. She's almost a year old. She is an amazing dog. She was a rescue from the SPCA, so kudos on that. My wife and I have definitely made the right choice in getting her. Um, so, without further ado, let me introduce to you the Songbird Ocarina's Ocarina of Time. Now, what you see here uh, is a very nice blue glaze. It's got a platinum painted band with a couple of etched runes and the etched Triforce hand painted. Uh, this is a 12 hull, few in the front, couple in the back. Has a very nice warm tone to it. Um, it's relatively heavy, it is ceramic, so there is that. Uh, probably the only con to this thing is um, if you're a beginner, I don't recommend it because if you drop this, it will shatter. It's ceramic. So. Second thing that it comes with is this nice, neat little leatherish uh, carrying case that you got for it. And uh, that's just to keep the finish safe if you uh, when you're not in the process of using it. Last thing that it comes with is a songbook. This songbook has plenty of songs from the Zelda series. Will definitely keep you busy for quite some time uh, practicing and trying to learn and trying to figure them out. Most of the songs from the game are not easy. Um, that being said, let me get to demonstrating the sound. What I'm going to be doing is I'm going to be playing along uh, Lost Woods along with a video, so this way I can kind of keep time and hopefully not suck as bad as usual. Um, and I'm also going to move the mic up. Now you will hear kind of an echo to the uh, to the music. That's not me engineering the audio in any way. That's not me dubbing from any other kind of sources. It's just that I have a huge room around me and I don't have the money to do the sound treatment yet. So this room rings and reverberates and echoes and it actually comes to the point where if you clap over there in the center of the room, it sounds like a bell after a couple of seconds of the echo going off. Just quick demonstration, that's how long the room actually is. And it has all these weird angles and corners and everything else. So. Yeah, it's kind of a big room. I'm still in the process of fixing the house up, so need a little bit of slack for that. In any case, without further ado, here comes the music. This particular ocarina does not have the octave 
to hit that high note, so it's kind of why I cut off where I did, um, rather than embarrass myself. In any case, if you do have the money, it's about 110 and change, and then whatever shipping is, um, depending on where you are. If you are a serious Legend of Zelda collector, or if you um, really enjoy just learning to play interest, interesting new instruments, um, yeah, there is uh, definitely a good reason to get one of these. It's it's a lot of fun to play. It's easy to learn, difficult to master, but so is pretty much every instrument. So in any case, definitely, definitely recommend it. Uh, customer service is top notch. They shipped right away. Love it, love it, absolutely love it. Um, so in any case, if you've enjoyed this video, uh, by all means subscribe. There's really not much of a reason to at the moment because my channel is kind of all over the place and just generally not there. I'm probably going to be starting a new channel um, when I finally find a direction to go with, either with Let's Plays or I actually have a car that I'm in the process of building, a 1985 Pontiac Fiero. And uh, what I may do is record myself working on it and uh, upload a whole bunch of how-tos for various components on the car. So um, I don't know if that's the direction I'm going to go or if uh, reviews are kind of a direction I'm going to go or if it's just going to be Let's Plays. In any case, uh, I'm rambling now, so you guys have probably gotten what you want out of the video. Uh, hope you enjoyed. And again, uh, subscribe if you want. Not really worth it, but uh, have a wonderful day.